So first we're going to identify if this statements are identity or conditional and after that we're going to proceed on with the fundamental trigonometric identities in order to simplify um, expressions. So first one is x squared identity or conditional. So x squared minus 1 is equal to x minus 1 x plus 1. So identity statements are those statements that the, uh, the one side is equal to the other side or for all the domains they are all equal. For the conditional statement if there is one or two or more um, values of x or that's a where they could not be equal. So example for number one, x squared minus one is equal to x minus one, x plus one. So one way of identifying it would be easier if ito sila, ang x squared minus one, factored form niya tong x minus one, x plus one. Diba x squared minus one is x minus one, x plus one. They are just equal. So therefore, this is identity. Or another way is kapag mag, um, let, you're going to find or give a value of x. Tapos isolve mo dito, isolve mo rin dito. Halimbawa, x is 0, 0 minus 1 is negative 1. So 0 minus 1, dito side, the dito na side, it would be negative 1. So negative 1 kapag x is equals to 0. So dito, 0 minus 1, that's negative 1. 0 plus 1, positive 1. So negative 1 is negative 1. But be be conscious of this one because sometimes um equal sila but in the specific values of x hindi sila equal for example this one number two um this would be um difficult if this is simplified form so what you're going to do is you're going to find values so let x be equal to zero mana let x be equal to zero so if x is equal to zero so sine 0 or sine squared 0. So let's solve for that one. Squared 0. So in this side, this is 0 is equal to cosine 0 squared 1 plus 1, 2. two, two. They are not equal. So therefore, this is a conditional statement and one value is theta is equal to zero next um if let x be pi let's try pi you could have zero you could have pi but i think it would be easier kapag zero so sine pi sine 180 pi is 180 so zero is it equal or not equal? <laughs> not equal na agad. Kinupi dito kasi. So, cosine 180 minus 1, negative 2. So, they are not equal. So, therefore, this is a conditional statement. And one of the value is pi. So, we'll now proceed with the fundamental trigonometric identities. These are the identities which... um In fundamental in trigonometry. So, for tri trigonometry. So... These are um, circular equations. Cosecant reciprocal identities because they are the reciprocal. The reciprocal ng cosecant is sine. So reciprocal ng second is cosine, cotangent, tangent. So kapag nag-search as a C, S, S naman C. Ganyan. That's how I remember it. So cosecant theta is equal to 1 over sine. Second naman, partner niya kasi S siya. So, hindi niya partner si sine instead of partner niya si cosine. So, cosine theta. So, si cotangent, si tangent palagi yung partner. Quotient identities is kapag si tangent, sine over cosine. Pero kung si cotangent, cosine over sine. So, one of um, um way of remembering this one is ito naman siya. Kapag ko, mauna si cosine over sine. That's how I remember it. So, Next, Pythagorean identity is sine squared theta plus cosine squared theta is equal to 1. Tan squared theta is e plus 1 is equal to second squared theta. 1 cosecant cotangent theta is equal to cosecant. So, in this one, to remember that, ang sine, it's like cosine, ang tangent, second, yung mga C partners sa C. C tan partners si S. So, hindi yan sila mga co 
dito mga cool sila. So, this could have different varieties. Pwede mong gawing um, cos sine squared theta is equal to 1 minus sine squared theta. They are just the same. Transpose mo lang, or addition property, transpose mo lang si sine, maging negative siya. So, they are just the same varieties from this one. For even and odd identities, sine negative theta is equal to negative sine theta. Tangent of negative theta is equal to negative tan theta. While for cosine negative theta is equal to cosine theta. So, different lang sa cosine kasi ang cosine ng negative theta is the same as cosine of the positive of theta. So, what's the use of this one? We could use this one for simplifying um, circular expressions. So, first one is tan tan theta, cosine theta is equal to sine theta. So, we could simplify this just like fraction, two-fourths. The simplified form is one-half. So, that's, make it simpler so that it will be easier to understand. So, um, one of the ways to make it, to simplify it, is you're going to change it, change the expression in terms of sine and cosine. So, for example, for number one, tangent cosine theta over sine theta. So, it changed mo ang tan to sine over cosine. So, maghanap ka dito ng identities where ng tangent naging sine cosine. So, ito tangent siya, pero second... Ito, tangent siya, sine, cosine. Pero ang tangent pala is equal to sine over cosine. So, ang tangent dito, gawin mo siyang sine theta over cosine theta times cosine theta. Ito, kopyahin mo lang cosine theta over sine theta. Kasi nga, sine, cosine na sila, so you don't need to change them. So, ang tangent lang, ginawa mo siyang sine theta, cosine theta. To make it simpler. So, Numerator, denominator, pwede mong i-cancel. So, natira na lang sa taas si sine theta. Sa baba, si sine theta. Any number divided by itself is equal to 1. So, ito pala, si tan theta, cosine theta, over sine theta is simply equal to 1. So, that's the simplified form. So, diba? It's easier. That's why you need to simplify. Next, um, for number 2, so, cosine squared theta plus cosine squared theta tan squared theta. So, again, what you're going to do first is, itong mga cosine, let P, ang mga maliban na sa sine at sa cosine, you're going to change them into sine or cosine. So, ito, kopyahin mo lang si cosine squared theta plus, kopyahin mo rin si cosine squared theta. Si tangent magiging... So, tangent maging sine sine squared theta over cosine squared theta. Bakit squared na? Kasi squared si tangent, so si squared mo rin si sine as a si cosine. So, dito, kopyahin mo ito, si cosine squared theta. And this one, as you could see, pwede mo i-cancel si cosine squared theta. So, so, pwede mo yan siya cancel cosine theta squared or cosine squared theta. So, pwede mo yan cancel sine theta squared or sine squared theta. So, as you could see, cosine squared theta plus sine squared theta is Pythagorean identity. So, sine squared plus cosine squared, pwede yung baliktad cosine squared plus sine squared is equal to 1. So, ito siya, ang haba pala, it's simply equal to 1 pala. So, next one. So, for this one, 1 minus cosine squared theta over 1 plus sine squared theta. So, what you're going to do is, ito siya, gawin mo muna siyang one quantity or one term. So, kapag para gagawin siyang one term, parang one-fourth, one-half minus one-fourth. So, gawin mo siya, diba the LCM or the LCD is 4. So, so, ganyan ang gagawin mo. So, for this one, kasi ito lang denominator. So, yan siya, ang LCD. Tapos, kapihin mong 1. This is 1. It times mo sa 1 plus sine theta. Sa mo yung kinuha, dun sa denominator. Minus, ito siya, kapihin mo lang sa taas, cosine squared theta. So, next. Distribute 1 plus distribute sine theta minus cosine squared theta over 1 plus sine theta. 
Next. What will happen next is this one. As you can see, the 1 minus cosine squared theta. Diba nili? Ito siya. I just rearranged this one. Nearrange ko lang ito sa taas. 1 plus sine theta. As you can see, dito from Pythagorean identities, um, sine squared theta is equal to 1 minus cosine squared theta. Kapag ilipat mong cosine, so, ito siya, the same. So, ibig sabihin, ito pala siya, equal siya sa sine squared theta plus sine theta is equal to 1 plus sine theta. Next, may makancel ka ba? Yes, kasi pwede mo ito siya i-factor. So, sine theta, ang common, di ba, maki sine theta, sine theta. Dalawang sine theta, kunan mo na isa. Sin theta na lang natira. Plus, sin theta. Ang sin theta, divide mo by sin theta. It's 1. 1 plus sin theta. Can you cancel this? Yes, of course, you can cancel them. Kasi plus sila. So, pwede mo yung pagbalik talag. Pero kung minus to, hindi mo yun makancel. So, cancel this. That's simply equal to sin theta. So, ibig sabihin, ito pala siya. Simply equal to sine theta. So that's the answer. That's how you're going to simplify. And you need to uh, familiarize this one or you need to copy of the fundamental trigonometric identities. Thank you.